Yeah, so kind kind of with that, it's like so. Okay, let, let's keep going with a little bit of flat Earth idea a little bit, if you don't mind. So, what do you? So, you personally believe, for example, we just live on a plane, right? It's just a plane, right? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> cool. Cool. <laughs> cool. No, no, I'm just trying to see how much. Ask you how I was gonna say. Um, no, I I think from. <clears throat> from what I can, you know, see and experience and have so far, it doesn't make sense that the is the earth, like a global figure or like a global planet or whatever that doesn't exist. Yeah. No one, I don't think that anyone can go like out of this place here, or I don't think anyone can come in. It's just, a, <laughs> yeah, yeah. it's just like a plane with, I don't know what's, is it yeah. covered? You know, is it like a dome? Is it like, I don't know, but it's definitely not um, a fucking planet. That's why I can t guarantee you it's not. So how, how, would you, how would you explain? I talked about it before. I was kind of reiterate for the people who are not familiar with this channel. Like how, how could you explain like asteroids or like that kind of asteroids? Like those, the, the meteors that come. Where are they at to, though? Have you seen I'm just saying that? like in general, like have you ever seen like those videos, like those, those meteors, whatever. From a movie pictures? or what? <laughs> Russia, speaking of Russia, I've never seen any meteors or asteroids. No. Oh, I gotta find that footage for you then, bro. Let's find me some footage. Down. Give me some footage, bro. Let's. I'll break everything down for you guys. <laughs> Every video, you just gotta send it to me. You gotta, you gotta send it to me. You gotta break down the breakdown, right? I'm not gonna do uh, researching here for you guys for my beliefs. I'm. I'm just telling you what's my belief. Fireworks. <laughs> All right, you're about to see a fireball light up in the night sky. You're fireball. Aha, uh -huh. that's a fireball. Here we go. Entering the Earth's atmosphere. It entered the Earth's atmosphere. Mmm, yeah. yes. Just, just... By dash cams. Dash oh, cam yeah, footage. Okay. Oh, dash cams. Dash cams. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, this guy. Oh, we've talked about this guy. In why? Too. Why is it all different colors though? That's that's interesting to me. Why did the all these like meteors have like blue colors, yellow color, red colors? Space. It's space, <laughs> it's space bro. Come on. <laughs> what else we got here? Yeah, just keep uh, this mm -hmm. rope up those. There's a bunch of different links from different. Uh, a countries. lucky few, guys. A lucky few saw this. What is that? That's a meteor? <laughs> how come? Why is the meteor here? Here at this point, look how big the meteor is right here. Super tiny. And then all of a sudden, it's like huge. How, how is that possible? Distance. Distance. Oh, distance. Come on, distance now? That doesn't make sense. If it's in the distance, it should be the same size. Unless it's coming towards you. Yeah, if you're closer, I mean, that's what I'm trying to say. If you're closer, you're going to see it bigger. Today, stunned by this image, this was debris. A thousand people injured. Across the sky, there crashing into the ground in those woods, and look at some of the other. In but if you if you were to see that, would you be convinced then? You have to kind of see it in person, or are you that kind of? You'd have to see it yourself. See what? What are you gonna see? There ain't shit. Look at this. This is the meteor no, saying, right here. I'm saying if if that were to happen, if you were to see that, would you be convinced then? Or hit show me that. No, no, I'm saying for you, if you were actually there, like if you were driving, let's say you're on the highway mm -hmm. at night and you see that. Come from your dash dashboard dash cam <laughs> dash cam footage from your dash cam footage if you were to see that would you be like oh shit that's something right there I, I, if like, i'm I, if i would see that then i would see that you know i i would let me see it yeah i can't i can't uh say oh i'm gonna you know believe that's not real if i see it i don't know yeah but it doesn't look like that's a real thing how come i never saw one and uh, there should be, you know, like 
thousands and millions of of these shits out there if it's space yeah. is so huge and I, I, where is yeah. it at though where when is it coming you know it's, the, it's the only coming when out. the dash camps on it's only coming right. I, I think that right there we just said is what pisses people off on the channel when you say i haven't seen it myself so how can it be real i think that's what people get pissed off on this channel yeah that's fine guys, but it's not just me like it's yeah, yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. it's you know, those, you those haven't seen that. Have that the other people. person seen that? You know, right? Ha, do you know anyone in your family who's seen that? You know, it's like yeah, yeah. yeah. And it's not why? Why should why should why should that be such a crazy event, right? If there's like millions and millions of these things in space, right? Why is why does that have to be a super crazy thing? Yeah, because they they should be coming here meteors every single day, right? According to space, the unlimited yeah. space we that we have. NASA, NASA? here we go. I think we know, we know more about than the oceans. But... It, came out of it came out of nowhere. First of all, when it comes out of nowhere, how, how is that possible? How can something come from nothing? That makes no sense. Yeah, yeah, that's what I want, I want to get into as well. I'm, I'm glad you mentioned that. Yeah. yeah. Followed by an almost apocalyptic scene. Apoc a cop apocalyptic scene. How come how come nobody watch this? How come nobody if they're watching this and seeing this coming in is swerving or being like, fuck, get the fuck out of here. Everyone's just driving the same. No problems. All hell broke loose. All hell broke loose. Yeah, this is the famous one in Russia. Wow. Students were lucky. Protected by curtains from the flying glass. Protected by curtains. What are these curtains that are protecting glass? Some strong ass curtains. In the streets. What the hell was this? This guy got into a like a styrofoam wall and it just fell. Look at this. What the hell is that? Paper, paper wall. People started to panic. Somebody screamed, "The end of the earth!" He says. The end of the earth. The meteor was captured on cell phones and on dashboard cameras of cars. So popular here in Russia. Where? The blast was so powerful it knocked down a wall at this factory. Oh really? Over twelve hundred people were injured. Mostly from broken glass. Three thousand buildings <laughs> damaged. Over a million square. Three thousand buildings damaged. Where are these three thousand buildings? <laughs> Look at this guy, bro. This guy is like wrapped up. Shattered and bounced back on me. My beard was cut open. This man says. The meteor was believed to be about 50 feet wide. 50 feet. It was 50 feet wide. You know how fucking big that shit is yeah dude 100 tons that's about the same 7700 tons same as the eiffel tower the and eiffel tower raced towards earth at over 40000 miles per hour 40000 miles per hour the atmosphere mm. it began to break into pieces causing those booms and sending those powerful shock waves towards the ground mm -hmm. and why so first of all this is a, also a question i have is why why does the a rock right it's apparently it's a rock right yeah moving through the space goes into the earth and then shatters it shatters it shatters and there's some sh sort of atmosphere apparently that is shattering this rock it's getting through that speed whatever through what what is that force bro yeah, but what is there? What is there then? What is in that? If there's nothing, if you can't see nothing, you can't see no atmosphere, how is it all of a sudden there's some layer of some some gas around us or what? What are you trying to say? You know, and then there's no way you can like burn a rock. There's no temperatures on Earth that can burn rocks. Never seen no bur rocks burning. Have you tried to <laughs> have you tried to ro burn rocks? Nothing happens. This is my pastime, bro. Come on. <laughs> Rock burning. It's like, and apparently <laughs> some atmosphere burns us 50 feet, 50 <laughs> feet meteor instantaneously. Wow. 
How how fucking it's hot is it up there? Forty thousand miles, whatever it says. The speed, the heat. That's just bullshit, bro. I mean, if, I mean, if you do a move really quick, like you you are gonna generate a lot of heat, a lot of energy. So that does. Okay, but how are you gonna? How, what is there though? What is above this, where we're living here, that can shatter fifty feet meteors and into dust, right? What is up there? What is that? Breaking up. Hmm? It's coming down. It's coming down. What is that? Do we have like a thin thin layer of lasers? Or what what do we have there? Like what is that? Ocean sphere, different spheres up there, whatever. The stratosphere, bro. It's the stratosphere. All that. Come on. <laughs> Ain't no fucking stratosphere, baby. Don't worry. <laughs> it looked like a scene like out of an action movie. That's what he's this guy's saying. It is an action movie. It's the new Tom Cruise trailer right here. Bro, I'm telling you. Ooh, and then apparently we have some some camera filming behind another planet filming Earth. Okay. You're watching Izzy and Ibra TV.